guys? So I'm back with another style for the summertime series, and this one is number six. And I am loving this style. I call this a classic style. I don't know, it just reminds me of something back in the day, but classic, you know? So the products that I'm using for this style is some Shea Butter Mix. I'm also using the Mazzani Twist Coil and Jelly. And to top that off, some grape seed oil. So I really hope you guys enjoy the video, and I will see you guys a little later. Starting on old hair with a messy part. I'm going to keep this part so I'm going to straighten it up. Now that I've done that, I'm going to head in the back. And I'm going to finger part me a medium sized section. Once I've got my section, I'm going to put the rest of the hair away. First, I'm going to do some detangling. And then I'm going to add some of my Shea Butter Mix. I'm also using some of the Mazzani Twist Coil and Jelly. And to seal that in, I'm using some grapeseed oil. After applying all the products, I'm going to split this section in half and start to two strand twist. Now my idea for this style was a bunch of big twists, but as I started twisting, I realized I needed more twists, so I added some medium twists to the style. I wanted to come up with a quick style for you guys since my last style was a all day style, and I did. And not only is it a quick style, but it is a nice, elegant, old fashioned, I call it a classic style that just stands out. After I'm done with this section, I'm going to do the same thing, finger part another section, do some detangling, add some product, and start to two strand twist until I get to the front. Now that I'm at the front, I'm going to split this section into two sections. I'm going to do this to the same section on the other side. I decided to add some small, short, flat twists to the style right next to the part. So this is the part that I'm creating for those flat twists. But before I do the flat twist, I'm going to twist up the rest of the hair. And I'm still using those same products in that same order. Once I'm done with this section, I'm going to move over to the other side and follow the same steps. I'm going to create that part first and then two strand twist the rest.
as I work on my last twist, once I'm done, I'm gonna show you guys how all of the twists look. And then I'm gonna show you guys how the flat twist that I did off camera look on the other side. And then I'm gonna create the same kind of flat twist on this side. As you can see, all of the flat twists are on the small side and they also all will be facing towards my back and I'm only flat twisting them halfway. Once I'm done flat twisting, I'm going to grab a couple of flat twists together, comb them out together, and then twist them up together. And I'm going to do this to both sides. And once I'm done, I'm going to put my bonded on and head to bed. So it's the next morning and I'm heading out. But first I'm going to show you guys how my twists look. It looks like they shrinked a little bit, but that's fine. Starting with the back first, I'm going to grab one two strand twist at a time, bring it towards the middle, and then pin it down. And I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. Once I get in the middle, there's really no order on how I pin these twists down. I'm just pinning them down wherever they fit. And now that I'm at the front, I'm pinning this section down going towards the back. And then once I get on the other side, I'm going to pin the first row down also going towards the back. And then for the rest of the twist, I'm going to pin them where they fit. And for this side, I want this side to look more higher than the other side. So as I pin the twist down, I am pinning them on top of each other, just to get that look. And once I'm done pinning, I'ma look around for anything that needs to be fixed, and then I'm gonna show you guys the final look. So I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you want to watch more, please do not click right here. I will have all of my information down below, my main channel, my previous video, where I get my music, and all of the products that I've used in the video. So I'll see you guys in my next one. Until then, goodbye.